All right, guys, this is what we're doing today. We're gonna have fun with this. We're gonna try to get a limit of crappie in 60 minutes. That's our goal. And typically what I do, look at that sunrise coming up. Is that not the nicest thing ever? Uh, what I typically do is a tin and in. So if it's 10 inches or longer, it goes in the live well. Um, so there will be fish we're gonna be throwing back because we're definitely gonna catch smaller ones too, but we're looking at getting the fastest limit we can get uh, and be back. The only way I know how to do that, uh, just so I know, I'm gonna show you the time on my Helix when we catch our first, and then we're gonna show the, the time on the Helix when we catch our last. So that's how we're gonna do it. Should be exciting, it's gonna be really fun. Um, we came really close yesterday to getting it done. So that's our goal today. We're gonna see if we can make it happen. So check it out though, still water, beautiful. Right now, let's do this. So here, I'm gonna keep track with this counter. I haven't had a counter in my boat in a long time, but I'll tell you what, the fishing's been so good, I've had to. Uh, guide trips have been smoking it. So uh, when they start getting up there high in the numbers, we have to keep track, definitely with the clicker. And I do that with my foot. I do that with my foot, as you can see it down there. Uh, it just makes it a lot quicker. And I only have to think about it. So right now we're just looking for a fish, our first fish, and then that will start the clock. There's our first fish. That would be at least a 10 incher and the time is 6.36, guys. And I wish I had picked a spot that was uh, had more fish in it because we're probably gonna have to move. But just to give you an idea of that time right there, 6.36, 6.37. Now I'm using the blue monkey today with the three pound fishing 132nd ounce jig head. Those are both available at threepoundfishing.com. Casting with the light stuff, sniping braid. You guys check it out. You will not be disappointed. It is freaking awesome. Just the smoothest casting stuff you're gonna find on the market today. All anchored with the hammer 10. And I can't say enough good things about my hammer tan. Best darn 10 footer on the market. That's a small guy, I can't count him. And yeah, I didn't pick a pile that had a ton of fish. So unfortunately, I'm gonna cost myself some time going somewhere else, probably, but we're gonna stick it out here for a little bit and see what we can't do. Oh, and we did get them. Look at that. That's a keeper. Played him like a fiddle. Yeah, that's a keeper, baby. Clicker. Good fish right there, good fish. We are uh, still collecting fish for the uh, fish fry. Gonna be doing it for a while. Quite a few people show up for it, so we need a lot of fish and I supply it. That's gonna be a small guy. 
All I'm doing now casting guys, just casting out to them, keeping it on top row. Uh, definitely a, uh, perhaps a smaller fish pile here for whatever reason. Um, but seeing how many fish we can get in quickly, at least the size that we need. Playing them and then we'll just move on. It's really hoping for more fish here. There's a good fish. Found ourselves a school moving in. Now these fish are moving, but at the same time, they seem to be pretty darn active. They're actually peeling off the moving pile. See how they come right there to it? Boom, we got them. Um, so that's a really active pile, even though they are moving. Now, I always say that's definitely a good keeper there. Um, I've always said that moving fish, they tend to have a goal in mind, so they don't want to bite. But obviously, that's not always the case. All right, we're going to change to the uh, hair jig now. The brown recluse. Brown recluse. This bait has been deadly. All right, so we're gonna have to move. Uh, just not enough fish over there, so we're just moving. Got seven fish in the boat. It is 7.04 now, so we're almost about halfway done with our hour. So it's gonna definitely need to pick up massively to get the 60 minutes down, but who knows? Could happen. Could happen. We're taking quite a bit of time to move and we're not willing to start up the big motor, so we're trolling for it. Dabba dabba do. Just caught an absolute pig. Probably the biggest fish in the last two weeks, three weeks anyway. And I didn't have the camera on, of course. That's how it works. But I'll show you on the cleaning table. Right now we're at 7.17, so not, still not an hour yet, but we have definitely picked up the pace on the fish. We're also catching smalls. We're at 14 fish right now, 14 fish. So we're halfway done and we're only at 7.18. If you look at the clock down there, 7.18. The limit here is 30, so definitely Pretty big number to get to, but all right. Current number is 20, and we it's been an hour, so 20 fish in an hour, not very good. But we've had to really move around quite a bit, um, which takes a lot of time. So I could have went to a spot that I knew that had a gazillion fish, but unfortunately I didn't. So I think it's going to take us another. 20 minutes maybe to get these 10 fish but as you can see on the screen tons of fish right here all right guys i am decided to make a run over here with my trailer motor so i know i'm not going to make the time 747 right now look at that time right there currently have 24 just being transparent 24 24 good fish i'm still going to bring you to the uh, table when we have our total 30 uh, but i don't need to catch six more but i'm going to make a big trolley motor move to the other side just uh jack around a little bit but that was fun uh definitely could have picked a spot that would have got them even quicker but uh, i think i got good quality fish which is you know something i i like but totally cool uh you guys check out the hammer 10 at three pound fishing.com loving it super sensitive pair it up with that sniping braid i'm just telling you right now that optimized if you're in the southern states or midwest anywhere like that is awesome as well i use it quite a bit uh, on my home lake i use the optimal for casting i love it casting wise check out the great sponsors cornfield fishing gear ptg oh everybody man 
Wind Rider is going to be on board. Original Fish Formula, Hog Fishing, all of it. And the new products are all on their way. So, beautiful morning. Beautiful morning. Should be off the water here by 8, 8, 15, something like that. Check out TikTok too, by the way. But I'll bring you to the uh, cleaning station here shortly. All right, guys, there you go. There's a limit. And I can tell you that it took about an hour and 25 minutes. So, not bad considering that I didn't really go to a place that was jacked with fish. But this was the big boy right here. Pound and a half. Really solid fish right there, man. All the others, really good eaters. Uh, definitely good eaters. Gonna line them up here for a photo, but yeah, what a great day. What a great morning, quick. Hey guys, check it out the, uh, the website, threepoundfishing.com. A lot of products being added right now, and uh, we appreciate the support, sharing the videos, and please subscribe. Have a great one, guys.